Um, I heard that some people are wanting um, an extension that allows you to highlight text on a web page and then share those highlights with a student. Um, so this is a video on something that's offered by marker.to. It's called Yellow Highlighter Pen for Web. So this is a free extension and I'm going to show you how it works. So you can go to the Chrome Web Store and type in Yellow Highlighter Pen for Web and search for that and then you're going to add to Chrome, add extension, And it takes you to a little how-to page, which is nice. And you can see up top here um, that it has shown up as like this little yellow highlighter. So now I'm going to go ahead and go to a web page that has a story on it. And I'm going to click the pen. And a little toolbar is going to show up. Okay. So now I can just hover over. And perhaps I want to highlight this sentence here. And I can click on the little pen here and I can change the color of the highlight if I want. Um, and I can also tag things, but you don't really need to worry about any of that. So let's just do a regular highlight. Now what it's done is, um, here I'll highlight a few more things just for practice sake. There we go. So now it's created this link. And what I'm going to do is copy that link. And I can send this link to any student that I want to see the highlights that I've made on this page. And the student does not need to have this extension in order to view it. And I'll show you what I mean by that. I'm going to open an incognito tab. And the reason I'm opening this is because in the incognito mode, none of my extensions exist. This isn't my Google account. I'm not actually locked in, logged into a Google account in here. So I'm able to see what it would look like for a student who doesn't have the extension. I'm going to paste the link press enter, and look, I'm able to see all of the highlights that you made for me. Um, it does say, would you like to highlight web that? So it's saying, do you want to install it? But you do not need to, you can still view it. If the student wants to highlight, then they would need to get the app, but they could just follow along with this video as well if you wanted them to. So hopefully that is helpful. It's just as simple as getting the extension and clicking that button and highlighting away copy the link, send it to the student, and they should have no problems opening it and being able to read it. I hope that's helpful. Thanks.